Welcome to category number six, songs about musicians. Number one, in 1982, Paul McCartney recorded the song Here Today, a tribute to what bandmate in the Beatles? Number two, the plane crash that took the lives of Buddy Holly, Richie Valens, and the Big Popper inspired what 1971 hit by singer-songwriter Don McLean? Number three, the 1975 Pink Floyd song Shine On, You Crazy Diamond, was written in honor of what former bandmate who left the group in 1968 over his drug use and declining mental state? Number four, Joey Johnny, D.D. Tommy sang singer-songwriter Kevin Morby in his 2017 song, One, Two, Three, Four, his homage to what groundbreaking punk band? Number five, what band is the subject of a 1996 song by band Nerf Head Herder that features the lyrics, Can't You Hear Jamie Cryan? She's Running With The Devil. Number six, Roger Taylor and Stuart Copeland were two of the famous drummers who played on Under a Raging Moon, Roger Daltrey's 1985 tribute to what late rock drummer? Number seven, written as a tribute to singer Billie Holiday, Angel of Harlem was a 1988 single from what Irish rock band? Number eight, the 1985 Bruce Springsteen B-side, Johnny Bye Bye, was about the 1977 death of what king of rock and roll? Number nine, which member of the Beach Boys was, was the subject of the 1984 Lindsey Buckingham song, D.W. Sweet? And finally, number 10, the final Queen recording to feature bassist John Deacon before his retirement was No One But You, Only The Good Die Young, a 1997 eulogy to what late Queen frontman? You may now pause and rewind the video if you'd like to rehear any of those questions, and I will now read the answers for category number six, songs about famous musicians. Number one, in 1982, Paul McCartney recorded the song Here Today, a tribute to what bandmate in the Beatles? That was John Lennon. Number two, the plane crash that took the lives of Buddy Holly, Richie Valens, and the Big Bopper inspired what 1971 hit by singer-songwriter John McLean? That is American Pie. Number three, the 1975 Pink Floyd song Shine On, You Crazy Diamond was written in honor of what former bandmate who left the group in 1968 over his drug use and declining mental state, that was Sid Barrett. Number four, Joey Johnny, D.D. Tommy, sang song, singer-songwriter Kevin Morby in his 2017 song, One, Two, Three, Four, his homage to what groundbreaking punk band, that was the Ramones. Number five, what band is the subject of a 1996 song by band Nerf Herder that features the lyrics, can't you hear Jamie crying, she's running with the devil, that was Van Halen. Number six, Roger Taylor and Stuart Copeland were two of the famous drummers who played on Under a Raging Moon, Roger Daltrey's 1985 tribute to what late rock drummer? That was Keith Moon. Number seven, written as a tribute to singer-songwriter Billy Holiday, Angel of Harlem was a 1988 single from what Irish rock band? That was U2. Number eight, the 1985 Bruce Springsteen B-side, Johnny Bye Bye, was with the 1977 death of what king of rock and roll? That was Elvis Presley. Number nine, which member of the Beach Boys was the subject of the 1984 Lindsey Buckingham song, D.W. Sweet? That was Dennis Wilson. And number 10, the final Queen recording to feature bassist John Deacon before his retirement was No One But You, Only The Good Die Young, a 1997 eulogy to what late Queen frontman? That was Freddie Mercury. Score your round of 20 and join me next for our final category, number seven.